I used to try to motivate my audience by saying, you can achieve six-figure income, seven-figure incomes, whatever it is the number of the day is. And I used to motivate my, my audience that way because the, the other business experts around me were also motivating their audience in that way. I thought that was what you had to do. And over the years, I've come to see that that is actually quite a damaging thing for people. Because here's what happens. Audiences consume content about achieving six figures and seven figures. They get inspired, maybe even motivated to do some big work on one day or the next day. They maybe launch something and then they realize, oh my gosh, my results are far less than what that business expert is talking about. And so they think, well, it must be me. I must not be very uh, skillful. I must not be charismatic enough. I must not be hardworking enough. Maybe this isn't for me. And so people get into all kinds of discouragement when they consume the content, the kind of content that is talking about six figures and seven figures. So I stopped doing that. And I recommend that if you're still following any business experts that are influencing you about reaching six figures and seven figures, you might want to look the other way. You might want to unsubscribe or unfollow because it's probably not helping your mindset, to be honest. So instead of six or seven figure incomes, what should we focus on? I recommend that we focus on the next doable goal. The next doable goal. So if you're setting a, and the next doable goal must be within a time frame that is short enough for you to realistically set, say, oh, I can definitely achieve that this month. I can definitely achieve that this week. I can definitely achieve that today. Now, what is doable is different for everybody. So you have to figure out by, by experimenting and by practicing goal setting and, no, and observing yourself what is doable for you. Because if you set a doable goal and achieve it today, guess what? You have just built a brick in your grounded confidence. Brick by brick, you will grow a truly self-empowered life where any goal you set, you know you can achieve, not because you have to listen to some motivational content or watch some you know, inspiring videos, but every, any goal you set, you know you can achieve because you look at your own history and it's obvious that you can achieve it because you know how to set goals, set the right goals for you, you know how to define success for yourself, and you know how to focus every day with joyful productivity on doing what is doable today. So that is my encouragement to you and assignment to you today is to, well, two assignments. One is to start noticing the success, the success experts you follow, the business experts, the marketing experts you follow. Notice if they're trying to motivate you by saying six figures, seven figures, eight figures, whatever it may be, because that's probably not helping your mindset, honestly. And secondly, the assignment is to learn and practice setting doable goals for today, for this week, for this month, so doable that it doesn't require any affirmations for you to believe that you can do it. A goal, if it requires affirmations and hypnosis to believe you can do it, you're probably setting a goal, setting yourself up for failure, so-called failure, which is really a discouragement experience. And you don't need that, right? What we need is, now, one more thing I'll say before I go is some people say, well, if I set such doable goals, I might be falling short of my potential. Uh, I might not be thinking big enough. Now, here's what I have to say to that. Have you actually tried a year or even a month of setting very doable daily goals, achieving them, and see how that makes you feel. Well, I have. I've been doing it since actually 2014. Now, before that, from 2009 through 2013, I was motivating people with you know, six-figure, seven-figure income type things. Starting 2014, I really reset 
I really came to having a spiritual breakdown, breakthrough, and I really reset how I thought about success and how I spoke about success. And ever since then, I've been doing doable goals. Guess what? My income has only gone up every single year. And now I am definitely, I've been in six figures now for several years, <laughs> but it's, and I'm not going seven figures now. No, I just set the next doable goal, maybe stretching just a little bit every day, stretching just a little bit every week or every month, just a little bit, but it still feels doable. And every time I achieve the goals, I feel good. I celebrate along the way because achieving goals creates more confidence within yourself, doesn't it? And that confidence grows and grows and grows. And with, you know, within a year or two or three, you realize you can achieve anything, truly anything you want, because you know how to set goals correctly. You know how to achieve them every single day. And you know how to focus with joyful productivity. And so it's just, and I, I, so I keep surpassing my doable goals every year. Right? So how, law of attraction people, what do you say about that? I just keep surpassing. I set a very doable goal, but I keep surpassing them every single year. Why? Because of grounded confidence. And that's what I want for you as well. So I hope this is helpful. I'm George Cow, uh, authentic business coach. I love talking about how do we grow a business truly with integrity and with grounded confidence. All right. I hope I wish you well and I will see you in the next video or episode. Thank you for joining me.